Oh, what's going on, everybody here, and welcome to Forever Skies. I am so excited to be here playing this. I have been wanting to play this for so long, but today it's it's exciting because not only are we playing Forever Skies, we actually sponsored by Forever Skies. So huge shout out to Forever Skies for sponsoring this video. I am so excited to be checking this out. I have a link down below. The game releases on June twenty second, so if you want to check out the link down below and uh, get that wish listed or go ahead and pick it up depending on what time you know you're watching this but uh yeah we're gonna go ahead we're gonna hop on into this i am so excited now if you never played forever skies oh hold on we're gonna go ahead i'm just gonna delete my saves because they are not gonna be good anymore so uh we're gonna go ahead and start a fresh new save if you've never seen uh forever skies oh my gosh like you you gotta think of like think of like a green hell raft subnautica things like that like like those type of games like it's exploration it's fun um we're gonna go into normal mode i'm not doing permadeath no thank you but we'll hop into normal mode here. Uh, but yeah, so right now it is early access. So we're in early access. The story is started, but it's not finished. Kind of like, you know, how uh, Subnautica and whatnot, like, you know, they, they finished the story as they went. And it was, it was pretty cool. It's pretty exciting to uh, kind of like play through as that was developed. But we have a little bit of story and uh, a whole lot of exploration to do. I'm so excited for this. <laughs> okay, here we go. We're landing. Now, I did play this way back when there was a, a demo available, so I'm actually kind of curious to see what, what story elements are. Oh, okay. Let's grab this broken signal. Sagittarius 2 went from uh, went silent for months, then this one signal and silence again. None of us know what awaits you there, but if, it, if there's a chance that they have found the virus, then maybe we can survive. Find the virus samples at all costs. The fate of it depends on you. Uh, the Ark. So basically, what looks like happened is some virus thing broke out everything's doing horrible terrible awful things and we need to like you know fix it you know like standard uh emergency escape ejecto doro oh my gosh so this takes place like up in the uh, kind of like up in the atmosphere as you can see everything's like overgrown and oh it looks super cool i'm so excited to be back playing this all right let's see let's make our way over here now i did play through this part briefly so uh Okay, check the database for details. So we need to go ahead and find some things. Can we pick up anything here? Oh, wait, this is a blue cord. What is this? Take machine parts, more machine parts, even more machine parts. <laughs> okay, let's see. Uh, let's see, this door is locked. So we need to go this way first. Requires solid state battery, no power. We're gonna grab all the goodies. You always need all of the goodies. Uh, what do we have in here? <gasps> more machine parts. Uh, okay, so it's all gone to hell. Everything's have been screwed up since we found that virus. We're all getting six equipment. Equipment is breaking down, and then there's no situation. The power blew out again. The door is locked. I'll check if I if the beacon tower has a compatible battery. So that to me means we need to go to the the, the tower and see if there is a battery in there. <gasps> oh look, some suits and stuff. Anything there? Anything there? No, 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 no. Okay. All right, let's go up here. I see these cords laying everywhere. I wonder if we're gonna like do anything with those. <gasps> hey, sun melon. Any more sun melons? Oh, more sun melons. They look like cantaloupe. Uh, so there's our solid state battery. It's kind of funny. That looks like where the, the fuse would go normally. Uh, anything else up here? Concrete? Okay, I don't see anything else up here. So let's go throw the solid state battery into the deal over here. And look at this. Okay, uh, we were down under the dust. We found the lab where they first analyzed the virus 400 years ago. That's when it all started to go to hell. No one went crazy. The bastards stole the sample. Our airship broke the radio or and broke our radio, leaving us here to die. He's dangerous. The location of the sample is at the last, is at the overgrown glass house. The scientists live there who studied flora from under the dust. If you want to get there, try visiting some radio towers and wind farms to get necessary devices. Be careful, the world is no longer this world no longer wants us. It's not a place for us humans anymore. Interesting. Okay, so I think with that, I think the door opens. Yes. Okay. Cool. Uh, so let's go ahead. We gotta we gotta grab all the things. First aid kit. More machine parts. Trying to make sure I don't miss anything. Oh, there's a there's a, a no longer uh, a live person. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Uh, it's all because of this dust. No one heard voices. He was mumbling about nature surviving everything even the fall of the world he said he knew what to do so we could return to earth again he wanted us to help him to follow the voices in his head lunatic we locked him in his cell for his own good but he hid the extractor and ran off with it while everyone was asleep 
So I'm gonna tell you right now, this is what I think. You ready for this? From, from playing other type of survival games, if somebody starts going crazy hearing voices and they have very detailed drawings and things like this, um, you know, they might not be crazy. They, they might not be crazy, you know what I'm saying? Cause like, if we look at these drawings, well, I, I mean, maybe the drawings don't have anything, but it looks like, it looks like if we help mother nature, mother nature will fix everything and help the humans. Cause like, like growing people, mm, I don't know. Um, okay, hold on, let's make our way up here. Yeah, look how nasty it looks down there. The virus the virus hey it's the airship oh this is like the best part of the game i'm so excited to get into that okay uh let's see hold on so we've got let's go into here uh what do we got here uh photophobia virus research my research on photophobia virus has shown that it can be cured with lectin it's great source of it's great source are dust moths and other things living in the dust layer i prepared a lure to attract these objects uh, use it with the insect catcher on the airship, lower it into the dust and wait for the catch. The food from this world eaten raw may be harmful. I'll leave a membrane for the water condenser just in case some water will be needed to cook the food. Okay, so... Oh, now we're thirsty. So water condenser, we got gloves, we got the, um, the lure, old food ration, more mechanical parts, more first aid kits. You gotta loot everything. If you don't take it all, like, what are you even doing? Uh, can I squat? Yes. Um, all right, let's go up here. All right. Oh, not good. So we've got, um, I don't want to drink the dirty water. Did we not find any bottles? I don't think we found any bottles yet, did we? Is there anything out here? Oh yeah, more goodies. Let's head back down because now we go. Oh, I'm so excited to start building the airship and getting all the tools and stuff going. Oh, it's going to be so exciting. Oh, okay. So we've already got a water condenser and we've already got a, uh, a lure module thing interesting okay that's actually really cool all right let's see what else we got in here we got a transformer um i've been building a new airship for two months since noah got away with our equipment uh if only my workshop hadn't collapsed i'd already be i already have the airship engine research completed place the rudder place the fabricator craft the deck extractor extract the wall blocking the workshop get the research station expand the airship not yet. It needs resources for further locations. Okay. So we got a fabricator. So let's throw the fabricator. I don't know. Maybe right here. Okay. Take these. Return to to do less. Return to the planet. Deck extractor. Um, that is what we need. That's gonna be our like our laser thing, right? Now is that in here? Yeah. Deck extractor. Uh, craft. Take deck extractor. Okay, and then. If I remember correctly, I want to put it like right here. Then we can use it and well, bam, we can start extracting stuff. How cool is that? I don't know why, but like having a laser gun that extracts stuff is amazing. Oh, come here, you ball of stuff. You're mine. <laughs> this is cool. I love this thing. All right, we're going to take all of these. We're going to get everything here. Even the super secret door thing right here. Cause you know, oh, better get that while it's flying by. Okay, I think I think I've sucked up everything I could. Uh, so let's hop off of there. Now I think in my inventory, that's where all that stuff goes, right? Oh yeah. Okay, so there's synthetics, there's metals, and then some glass. Okay, so in here is where we needed to get through to. So let's grab the machine parts. Uh, blueprint research. I managed. I managed to repair the research station. There are a few old blueprints preserved in the memory card, but the most important one is the scanner. It's necessary to complete its research and craft it. After that. It should, I should, it should scan certain objects in the world so we can acquire more data for blueprints. I need a battery to run the device. I dug out this old power box from the ruins. The supply should be inside. Okay. There's that. Uh, do we need anything else here? What is this? Take research station. Oh, okay. Well, let's go put this in here. Uh, can we just set that maybe? Well, I don't want to expand it. I might need to go that way. You know, what about, what about on this side? <laughs> I don't know where to put it. I guess maybe we can put it right here for now. I don't know if we can, can we move it later? Uh, research station uses resources to analyze, discover research patterns to invent new item blueprints. Okay, hold on a second. So we opened up this little area right here. Let's get in here. So we've got that, bags, wall stuff. Oh, we're gonna take the poster. Oh, we're gonna place this on the airship. Heck yeah. Wait, was there another poster that I missed? Okay, oh, I'm about to starve. 
Um, all right, insert solid state battery. Use research station. Okay, so let's see. Machine parts, reward machine parts. Do we want to research this? Okay, so we threw a machine part in there and it's researching it. Okay, so did we, what, did we, what, did we get something? Machine parts requires fabricator. Oh, it's telling me how to, oh. So, okay, so if I want to research an empty bottle, I needed so many synthetics and then now it's gonna tell me that I can make them. Oh, okay, okay, got it, got it, got it, got it. Battery level's only at 90% though, not great. <laughs> um, scanner. So now we can actually go ahead and we can make an empty bottle. So let that do its thing, because we're gonna need the water. And then a repair patch. Take empty bottle. Okay, so let's see. Let's throw this into here. Can I can I place this on my inventory? Maybe I can't place it on my inventory. Do I have to go up here? Bottle dirty water. Drink dirty. I don't wanna I we need the cook. Do we have a cooking station? There are no available resources at this time. Uh water oh water purifier! Uh, do we have the stuff for that? Oh shoot. Okay. Yeah, we need to get that going too. Oh my gosh We got so many things to do. I need to expand the ship too. We got too much to do <laughs> uh, The ship definitely needs to be bigger though for sure. Can I make the tool for that because we also need to make the um, Okay, so let's see. Let's put that in there bottle dirty water Add dirty water. Okay fabricator. Let's see. What do we have for tools wise scanner updates database unlocks new studies in the research station Which can unlock new blueprints for fabricators but I need a, okay, so I need a thing for that. I need a battery. Okay, so that's not gonna happen. Oh, electric cooker. I need some more synthetics, a bed, machine parts. Interesting. So we don't have a way to, oh wait, hold on. We don't have a way to build, craft the scanner. Well, if I craft the scanner, I don't have a way to craft the scanner, do I? I need a solid state battery and I need synthetics. Okay, let's see if I can grab some synthetics. Are you synthetics? Yes. Okay, hold on. Let's see if we can get um, bottle clean water. Okay, so now use. Hey, look at that. Okay, um, and then what is this old food ration? I'm just gonna go ahead and eat that because I don't have anything else going for me right now. <laughs> so research station. There's nothing here. Oh, let's get this building. Is it gonna fall? Yes. That's so cool that they have uh, environmental things like that. Okay. Uh, oh, empty bottle right there. I feel like I'm missing something here because it wants me to craft the scanner, but I don't have a solid state battery for it yet. Unless there's another solid state battery somewhere. You know what? I mean, these lights are on. Oh, there's a solid state battery right here. There was one there and one there. Okay, I'm a dummy. I missed it. <laughs> I'm sure people were commenting. They're like, back in the box. All right, we're good now. Okay, so scanner. Now that we have that, that's going to make our lives a little bit easier. <laughs> All right, scanner. Okay, so we need to scan new objects. Uh, water, dirty water container, objects, dirty water. Okay, so is there, wasn't there like an engine or something like that over here that we needed to scan or something? Lucky for us, they highlight when we need to scan them, so. Oh, we can scan the people too. So uh, communication facility ruins, we're at 0% scanned. Okay, so we need to scan Scan synthetic clusters floating in the air Okay, so we can like scan like everything research engine and fuel. Oh Because that was a basic resource. Okay, hold on. So there's actually a metal one too uh, That we need to scan once it comes blowing around a lot of synthetics I was looking for uh, the metal one that guy right there um, okay, so that just basically told us the tool required was a deck extractor. Research engine and fuel. Oh, this is exciting. Okay. Um, I might need more food though. <laughs> and I might need more ship. <laughs> okay, so engine and fuel. Um, I need more synthetics. All right, so engines and fuel. Let's go ahead and get that one. Battery level's at 60%. Engine requires fabricator. Synthetic fuel requires fabricator. Okay, so small storage, water condenser, and membrane. Uh, so let's see if I go into fabricator, engine, and synthetic fuel. Okay, so I need more synth- I need more synthetics. I need a lot more synthetics. Okay, so hold on. Is that what it wants me to do? Yeah, crafted engine. Okay, so let's craft an engine. And I need fuel. I need, I need food. Do I have any more food? Um, I do. <laughs> okay, let's eat that. Since we don't have our food thing yet. Uh, and let's go ahead. I need to get more raw materials. Okay, so our engine is done. Craft the engine. Place the engine on the external part of the airship. Okay. Place on your airship. 
Uh, oh, I can't place it right here. It's like a no-go. Uh, but what about right there? That looks all right. Yeah, 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 look at that. We got an engine. <laughs> craft synthetic fuel. Okay, so synthetic fuel. Go ahead and let that craft do its thing. We've got an engine. Awesome. Fabricator's finished working on synthetic fuel. Okay, so now it's gonna have me apply the fuel, right? Um, let's see. Open fuel tank. Where is fuel? Boop. Depart the location. All right, we're moving. We're heading on out. So, um, okay. All right, let's do this. Let's do this. I'm excited. Uh, control ship. Heading. Altitude. Lock speed. Can't go up any higher. Heading. Speed. Lock speed. Oh, shift control to go up. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, we're setting out. We're doing the things. Oh my gosh. So I obviously, I, I think our next stop is probably that place right there. <laughs> yes. Oh, this is super cool. Now, um, another thing with this game is is what they're going to do is, is kind of like, you know, it feels very subnautic -y, I gotta say. So we're gonna have like locations like this, you know, but then there's also gonna be like, um, you know, like very unique locations, like bigger, unique, more locations, I think added in the future. There might already be some right, right now. I don't know. Um, but when it comes to like these kind of like outposts and things like that, you know, so I'm oh, so I'm so excited. We need to get over here because um, I think there's where I think what we're looking for is when there's a beacon like this, it means that there's uh, batteries and batteries like the uh, the batteries are kind of like one of the one of the biggest things that we need and like try to find or whatever. So hold on. okay, we're going to try to land here. I hope we can land here. We should be able to land here. All right. And then we hit control to go down and we're good. Analysis we're anchored. Okay. Uncharted area. Preliminary analysis started. Okay. Analysis. All right. Let's see what we've got. So, uh, that's a, oh, that's scannable. Okay. So what is this? Wrecked basic turbine. Oh, that that's what gives us the uh, the lift. We're gonna take all of that. We got a transformer. We don't need a bottle right now. <gasps> oh, there's a mailbox. From the stories of my grandparents, the world before smog sounds unrealistically beautiful. Perhaps it was too good for humanity and therefore had to come to an end. The current one is appropriately crappy and meaningless, which fits everyone I've dealt with. We got what we deserve, so no, I won't lend you my books. One, because it's basically meaningless, and two, figure it out by yourself. Okay, um, so we got these. We got huge plants growing everywhere, and I'm almost wondering if that's like part of the story of like... Is there a virus that's causing the plants to grow or is there a virus and like the plants are, you know, trying to like, I don't want to say like trying to fix it, but trying to fix everything. You know what I'm saying? Like they're trying like the, uh, you know, mother nature's trying to heal everything. Okay. Let's go up here. We got to get a, so we can get open. <gasps> yeah. Let's see. Electronics. Can I scan that? Nope. Take this, take that repair patch. Better scan it. Okay, hydration level is no bueno. A data card. Uh, metal floor requires airship builder. Oh, we don't. That's right. We don't have the airship builder yet. So we must have to try. Oh, what is this? Take Led Zeppelin. Oh, that's cool. Um. Okay. So let's see here. Ooh, plastic scrap. That's a new one. Okay. Um. How do we get? Oh. There it is. Okay, so now, oh, more plastic scrap. Let's go ahead and hop down from here. Let's see what we can do. I might need to turn my uh, harvesting thingy around so that we can actually maybe get some of the, oh my gosh, this is like slightly like unsettling crawling up on here. Cause like it's a long, <laughs> it's a long ways down. All right, so what, what do we have? Eh. Um, can I pick you up? pick up okay and then can i put it right here and then we'll see what we can get from here yes perfect because we need that glass some glass up there some plasticky stuff is there anything else oh it looks like there's a roof piece that we got uh we're not gonna be able to get the door from here darn okay so let's see if we can research oh hello small storage water condenser oh airship builder that's probably what we need more than like anything uh, oh, you know what? We need water, huh? Okay, that looks good. And then, uh, oh, there's our turbine. Let's get that. That'll allow us to go up higher, which is why I think we found it like next, you know? 
Oh, do we have the, the Led Zeppelin? Can we hang it from something? Oh, look at that. That's so cool. I love that. That's so cool. Good for them. Um, all right. Now, water condenser and membrane. Oh, you know what? We're going to need that. We need the membrane. We already have the water condenser. But we need the membrane for sure. And then, let's see. Do we have the cooking airship builder? Oh, all I need is synthetics. All right. We better get some synthetics for that then. Come on. Where's this? Where's all the synthetics at? There we go. Do we have a cooker? Electric cooker. Oh, yeah, we need that too. You know what? Are we done here? We're done here. Let's do this. Let's go ahead and let's get up. And I don't know where. Oh, you know what? Actually, no, that's not really a great idea. Let's just actually let's set her back down. The reason it's not a good idea. Oh, ship was damaged. No, I came down too fast. The reason it's not a great, great idea is because uh, I need to do some building and it'd be better to be on a surface to do some building. Man, we are just out of range. There's there's more beacons right there. I don't think I have any other food, right? Oh, this is rotten food. Well, shoot. I actually have no food whatsoever. We need that builder then, because we get we gotta get we gotta get to uh, where we need to go. All right, come on. I need I need more synthetics. Okay, we have the synthetics. Okay, let me grab the airship builder, and then I'm gonna go ahead and get more synthetics while we wait. Can't even see anything now. All right, we got the airship builder. Okay, you know what? We're gonna try this. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and just go because I need food really bad and I haven't found food anywhere. So I'm hoping that maybe, how's our how's our fuel? Hoping that maybe if we go over here to one of these beacons, well, I'm hoping one that we'll be able to get there and two that it might have some food on it. I need to make the cooker and I need to make the lure. They, I know that's what like it said the main food source stuff was. Hello guys. I wonder if that's our fuel right there. I don't know. It's hard to tell him. Oh, good. We can land right here. We can land on that one. No problem. Oh, shoot. Fuel's depleted. Uh oh. <gasps> I have no fuel. Actually, this is a wonderful place to stop. There's things everywhere. Oh my gosh. I got infinite stuff here. Let's go. This is amazing. I definitely just need to stop here more. I just stop out in the middle of nowhere more often. Oh, should we break this thing down? All right. So actually with that, hold on. Let's get um, fuel. Let's go ahead and lower the lure. Lower lure. Take that. And then can we go ahead and make a cooker? Let's get that going. How do you know when this is ready? Lure in use. I think I have to like start pulling, right? Yes. Hey, we got a dust moth. All right, so now I need to place the cooker down. Hold on, let's get that in right there. Use cooking station. Okay, so we need to put, um, oh, I need a membrane. Okay, hold on, do we have a membrane? Uh, membrane, membrane, membrane. Water, membrane, let's make that. Membrane, put that on there. We'll get a little bit of water and then we'll get that. And then we'll cook that. Uh, oh, we grabbed our fuel. Let's go ahead and... Uh-oh. Oh, no. Open fuel tank. Oh, gosh. We can do it from in here. Okay, good. All right. Fuel tank is good. That's getting water. Um, do I... I don't have any dirty water on me, do I? Plus five water, plus 15 energy. Should I just drink that? Just drink that, I guess. We can't do anything with these because these are rotten. Dust moth. We need to cook that. It's got 22 minutes, essentially, remaining. Okay, bottle that. Throw that in there. Come on, let's go. I'm starving. I'm literally starving. Was that lure only good for one? Oh, no, it looks like it's good for another one. Let's go ahead and uh, lower it again. Yeah, I know. I'm working on it. Come on. All right, so you... <gasps> no, where'd it go? Oh, you only have so long? I didn't realize you only had so long. Oh gosh, I've already died. I'm terrible at this game. Okay, put that in there. Put that in there, boil. Oh my gosh. Oh, what is that? Dust lettuce? Oh my gosh, I can't believe that. I thought I was gonna, I thought like my health was, well, did my health go down all the way and I just wasn't paying attention? That very well could have happened. Okay, this is going fantastically. Um, let's go ahead and while things are going, let's grab some more goodies. I can't believe I died. <laughs> like I've already died. I'm that terrible at the game. All right, that's bringing up. That's looking good. Wow, the membrane is gone again. 
Oh, another dust lettuce. Put that back on there. All right, we're looking good. We got fuel in there. Everything's good. Okay, let's go ahead and let's let's hit it. Let's hit it. Oh, hold on. Uh, take boiled dust moth, and let's go ahead and throw in this. Boil that. And what does this do now? Plus 40 food? Holy moly. Eat that bad boy. Mmm, delicious. Is that down right now? Oh no, it needs another lure. Okay. All right, let's go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I think we're as high as we can get. Um, oh, also another question, uh, a couple more questions I know that are probably gonna be asked. Um, one is they are going to do a, I think a four person multiplayer. I think that's like 100% gonna happen. That It's just not, you know, in develop. It's still in development, so they're working on it. Um, but 100% they are going to do a multiplayer. So this game would be really fun multiplayer for sure. Cause you could like, have like somebody flying around, somebody out uh, shooting, getting all the stuff on all the goodies. So that's pretty cool. And then as far as console goes, because I know I'm gonna get console questions, is that is going to be something after early access. Um, once, I believe once the game is like done, then they'll consider uh, coming to consoles. So unfortunately console players, it's not like, you know, right, right now, right on the horizon. Okay, so let's see. I need to land in a way that I can harvest everything off of this guy. All right, there we go. I think that'll work. Nice and easy now. Okay, landed, perfect. All right, how's water and food looking? Okay, we got the boiled lettuce. Now, boiled lettuce, so this has a nine minute shelf life. This has, oh, a 20, well, okay. So it's definitely better to have it boiled or maybe boil it right before it goes bad. <laughs> that might be the key. Okay, so uh, let's go ahead. Let's actually, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and harvest this stuff right now whilst I'm thinking about it. All right, I think that's everything that I can harvest there. Do we have anything else down here? No, okay, all right, so let's run up here. Let's see what we got. So I don't have, I don't see anything. How am I hurting myself? I don't see anything in the way of scanning anything down there, unless it's those things. Are the moths eating my face? Oh, another poster. Take these. Or it could be the storm, I guess. Ooh, a membrane. All right, we'll take the, that. Oh, it looks like there's a ladder. There's a ladder. Or what's up here? Oh, what's this? Oh, it's gonna tell us about the moths. Uh, moths from uh, threat. Moths got foraging in large groups during the safety. Uh, the swarm is vigilant and scatters whenever there's danger due to their poor over eyesight. It'd be possible to catch them with proper equipment. Okay. I don't know why I came up here. <laughs> I have no idea. Right, let's make our way back around. I think we're good. I think it's everything here pretty much except for the, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, I want to go. Oh, there's a big, huge wind turbine on that one. So I wonder if the uh, I wonder if the places that have like the the white flashing lights are like uh you know a better place than the, the like the the red or amber flashing lights you know okay, hold on let's not use our health here I probably should go ahead and use a med kit oh can we shut these doors is there even a door here there is a door uh hold on let's use a health kit here did I use it oh that's health not energy okay I'm dummy. <laughs> Uh, all right, so that looks good. That looks good. Okay, hold on. So we've got what I prefer that 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 Insect lure, which is just basic materials Insect catcher we've got a bed. We've got uh, oh the basic turbine. That's right. We need to get that um, So and then we also have the builder. Oh my gosh. Yes, we have to, we absolutely have the builder. Okay, so build menu So it looks like the only thing we really have we have room Temporary room scaffolding frame. It gets damaged quickly. A base to build something else. A metal floor. A metal floor that's more durable than temporary scaffolding. Plastic wall. What is this? Catwalk. Can extend two squares beyond the main body of the airship. Okay, so. If I. It looks like I, if I wanted something, cannot place outside. Wait, so does that mean I have to place. Scaffolding frame and gets damaged quickly. A base to build something else. 
Oh, I can't put it there because there's an engine in the way. Uh, if, you know, what? I'm gonna go. Uh, wait, what? Cannot. It's not empty. Container not empty. Okay, hold on. So I actually need to go into open fuel tank. Let's go and take the fuel out. Pick that up. Flight speed reduced. And then let's go into here. Now, can I place the floor? No. Okay. Looks like we have to start with. Okay, so we start with that. And then can I place the floor from there? Aha. Okay, so we put the room in first and then the floor. Got it. Okay, well, hold on. How much? What kind of. Oh, yeah, that's expensive. Jeez Louise, that is expensive. Um, are we in a good spot to be collecting a whole bunch of this a whole bunch of these goodies? I think so. Looks like they're all coming from this direction. Well, not as good as we were earlier. Alright, hey, look at that. We've expanded it out a little bit. I know, it's super amazing. Now I want to go ahead and expand it out like, you know, two here, two there. I'd like to get these like expanded out, but you know what? Um <laughs> we we don't really have like the resources for that. So let's go ahead and pick this bad boy up here. And uh oh, you know what? Catwalk. What does the catwalk take? I don't know, free sources. Wait, what is that? What does it take? 10 synthetics and five metals. Um, okay, hold on. Actually, can I, <laughs> can I place? I want to use this. Actually, can I place that there? I need to place this back. I need to place this on the thing. Actually, I guess we could just place it here for now. Maximum flight speed increased. Wait, is that the front or the back? Oh, that, okay. <laughs> yeah, it's going the right way. All right, so we'll just place that there because then we can fill it from right there. And then back here, let's go ahead and grab research station. And let's see, was there anything else? No, that was like the only thing that we had right there. Okay, so that'll work. Look at, we got more room. Yes. Oh, we're doing the things. This is so exciting. I'm having such a good time, but that is going to end it. Thank you so much for coming out. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe as well for some more. And also, again, a huge shout out to Forever Skies for actually sponsoring this video. I'm super excited to be working with them. And uh, we will absolutely be back playing some more because, oh, this is such a good time. I am enjoying this. I cannot wait to explore and see what else is out there. Um, do some more airship building, all that fun stuff. But, yeah, thanks again for coming out. Have a wonderful day. I'll see you in the next one. Bye, everybody.